We just bought these two abandoned storage units. One for $40, one for $60. We're each going to take one and whoever makes more money wins the challenge. You pick which unit you want and I'll take the other one. Based on the pictures, I think I'm gonna do the $40 one that gives me $20 worth of room. I don't think that's fair, but it is what it is. Put down in the comments who you think is gonna win this competition and let's get right into the first storage unit. Today we decided to kick it old school and go with a little tiny five by five that barely has anything in it. We only paid 60 bucks and we figured, you know what? Big ones are getting a little gross. Let's take a break and go old school. Let's see what we can find. So a little backstory, there was a big storage unit here that I really, really liked and I was like confident I was gonna win 100%. But then, you know, 20 minutes before I went off, it got canceled and I just bid on this one as a tag along with it. So now we got stuck with just this little guy for 60 bucks. So let's hope that could pay off. So we got an absolutely ancient looking laptop here. It's a Dell, but I'm doing it the wrong way. It's thick with three C's. Yeah. What is that? What operating system are we rocking here? Windows XP. <laughs> Classic. Uh, will it even turn on? No. I think it's dead most likely. It's probably been in here for who knows how long. And let's go to one of these coats or this coat. That's actually a bag. I thought it was a coat. It's actually leather at least. We got a, what does that say? Selden? A Selden. Selden? Nice leather feeling jacket. Let me reach in the pockets. Can we get something? Come on, don't tell me. Just tell me you accidentally left a hundred in there or something. <laughs> something like that. Make nothing sure no in the, inside pockets. Nothing in the side pockets. Uh, there is an inside pocket. Come on. With nothing in it though. But still, nice leather jacket. Should be worth a little bit. Let's pull out this big old duffel bag here. That's a big one. It feels like it's closed, but there might be something buried within there. Let's check in the pocket first. Anything? No and no. Ugh. Stand. Ugh. Did we mention that this feels like very nostalgic? I know this right feels now. like 2017, <laughs> 2018. Charge running with deepest videos. Who's been watching us for that long? Let us know down in the comments when you started watching this channel. I'm kind of curious. Let's see what's in the duffel bag. If it's just clothes, and if it is, maybe we can get some jerseys or some nice coats or something like that. You never know. Clothes aren't necessarily bad. Like this weird shiny jacket. Meh. Uh, other than that, but. We will be checking, what is that? 7-Eleven. I will check, not on camera, because it'll take way too long though, the pockets of these jeans, because it is possible, you never know. It's happened to us a couple times, I think not a whole lot of money or anything, but it's out there. Let's throw that one aside. This one here, is it all closed as well? It does appear that it's gonna be all closed, is that? Oh, we got a defense logistics jacket. That's a nice. little interesting. So maybe military owned it but all the way down is just more clothes. Make sure there's no other side pockets that I'm not seeing. Uh, is that the bottom? Oh, that's the lock. I don't see anything else in there, so we're gonna just say that's clothes. Who doesn't love a crock pot top without the crock pot? That's one of my favorite things to find. A little crack. Oh, what's in this? This box here has got some weight to it, and it's got the person's name on it right there, so that'll help us out. Oh, papers, let's see. There's an ID sitting right on the front, actually, from New York, and a dime. Hey, money. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, is it all just junk? I'm just gonna flip through it really quick. We'll look through it in more detail once we get home. But right off the front, or right off the bat, it is looking like it's just gonna be a bunch of paperwork, unfortunately. Let's look on the other side. There's, oh, there's a quarter and a penny. Yes, we're at 36 cents right now. When you only pay 60 bucks for a unit, yeah, you don't need little, much. You don't. So from first glance, this looks like it's gonna be all paperwork. What is this paper that just fell out over here? This is from the Treasury of Virginia. How do you get a check from them? That's kind of weird, but all right. Let's pull down. Ugh, what the heck was that? This big old guy looked like clothes, but that does not sound like any type of clothes I've ever worn before. Let's see if that's what it is. This looks more like dress clothes, but what is making that clanking sound? That's the question. Let's... I think it was what? towards you, like over here. Was it? Oh, there it is. What is that? Uh, that thing. Not sure what it was. Stainless steel made in China. Whatever that's supposed to be. Um, this looks like though, it is gonna be all clothes. So let's just toss it behind us. And this one looks like shoes. You can see this in the picture of it. So let's see. They look like all brand new. They do, They are. 
Whoa. Dolce Vita is the brand. But yeah, these are, are they all the same shoe? Look at the bottom. They look uh, brand new. Yeah. Yeah, these are 100% brand new. They have the papers in there and, and everything. Nice. So we have what, one? I'm just gonna put out pairs of two shoes. I don't really know if they necessarily go together. Those do? Yeah, so there's two new pairs of shoes. And then these do, yep. Three new pairs of shoes. And then we got, let's see, this one and this one. Four brand new pairs of shoes. And then the last one right here is gonna make it five new pairs of shoes. Even at 10 bucks a piece, I mean, that's at least minimum. I'm hoping they're worth more than that. 50 or $60 back right there. I think this bag is all sheets and blankets, it looks like, but it looks, no, it's got a zipper on it. You see that? Not too right. sure what they are. Maybe Let's it's take a one out. Duvet. What in the heck is a duvet? <laughs> I remember Connie was talking about it, remember? Mm. You like, it's like a cover and you oh. put the cotton in there. Oh, that's They're pillowcases. Pillow Are they all new too? Like they've never been used. This is a bunch of, this is probably, I mean, I would guess, look how big this bag is. <laughs> that's probably 30 to 50 if I had to make my guess. Brand you know, new pillowcases. That's a good bag for the Mercy Mall. Yeah, this is perfect. Person. The shoes too, realistically. Yeah. This is good stuff here. I'll take it. I mean, to be so small and not have many bags in there, it's actually turning out decent. Yeah. Let's see. What's, ooh, look, there's some shoes hidden under there. Is this just a carpet? It's a nice color. I like that. Oh, mm -hmm. it's a prayer mat, actually. Oh. I'll <laughs> fold that up and set it right there. Now, look at these shoes right here. What brand are those? Daco, look at that FJ. It says Fendi, isn't it the Fendi logo? Yeah, this says Fendi on it, doesn't it? Fendi, yeah. These might be Fendi dress shoes. That's decently expensive shoes right there too. And they already they have um inserts in them too. And they're not too bad of shape really. They don't. They've been worn. You can tell by the heels, but not very much. So that could be money too. Let's see what other kind of shoes you got going on. Like some boots, anything inside? Again like worn but very very lightly and i don't see a brand name on these look on the inside sole let's see oh they're steve madden so that's not bad too and they're in pretty good shape set them aside uh let's see tommy hill figure and champion the hill figures are just have those surface stains like you take like an alcohol pad to this yeah. That'll come right off very easy and they'll it's look not, like in very good shape. It's not clocked. No. And these champion ones, on the other hand, they're fairly worn. <laughs> All right, what do you think? Save the hard bag for last or get into it now? I say save it for last. All right, go to the trash bag now? Yes. Guys, right now, it's for the small unit, for the old school fans, leave it a thumbs up. And go down in the comments ugh, and leave a comment saying, this unit was amazing if you watch this one. I miss these units, I really do. I like the big ones, don't get me wrong, but this brings back a nostalgic vibe. It does. The days. Okay, let's see what's in here. This looks very random. Um, ugh, this thing here is like, what is it all? It looks like paper, are you kidding me? Look, can you see that? Yep. Let me dig through it a little bit. Yeah, this looks like mostly all paper. Well, let's look in this one envelope that's open, just out of curiosity. Yeah, nothing in there. Well, that's not a good sign. Is that really what this whole bag is? You see this. Yeah. Why do you keep this? Why do people keep mail? There is this wonderful invention called the internet. It's super cool. And the trash can. And that too, yeah, it's really cool. I don't even know what these are. They're just, they're just random, random, random papers. Is that all that's in the entire bag? Let's try to go around a little bit, look under it. Uh, I'm pretty sure, ooh, look. Ooh, I hear money. Yeah, we gotta figure that out. <laughs> it's Hold like on. all the way at the bottom of it. I know, <laughs> what is this? Uh, Explore Ultra Blue, we'll test that in a second. I'll see that that is in a second. But where is the jingle coming from? I hear it somewhere. I see it. There's money down there. It's just laying there, not in nothing. It looks like it to me. Where at? Where's like my... right where your hand was. Really? I could. I mean, I can't I really see, but I found a pack of cigarettes. Any money in there? No. Um, where is the money? Like I'm wondering if there so, could be bills in here. You want to just like set that down and open it? 
Not like uh, dump it out. Hold but. on, you hear that? Listen. Yeah. It's like right here. It's so annoying. Oh, I feel it. I feel it. I feel changed. What do we got? What is this? Ow, I just got almost poked by this. Yeah, let's try your method. My my method's not working. Uh, well, this is coming on. This is a sheet. This isn't even oh, a bag. Oh, Yeah, this is just literally a sheet. Here. Well, there's a card. That's what we're hearing. Oh, it's just some pennies. Anything in the wallet down here, though? Pennies or money? There's still money, yeah. But nothing in the wallet. But now that we have it open, we can explore a little. Oh, there's a dime. <laughs> <laughs> we got 13 cents here. What's this? What? Official legal notice? Uh, easy pass. Yeah. Someone's going through tolls, cheating. I don't know what that is. But yeah, this this looks like a big old mess of paper with some change at the bottom. I almost forgot to open this right here, the tester thing. What is it? Cologne, you think? Yeah. Uh, let's see what it smells like. Should I just spray it? Get off. Let's spray it on my hand, make sure it doesn't smell bad first. No, it actually smells pretty good, and it's like brand new. I wonder if this is an expensive brand. I don't know, I might keep it, I think. I think it smells good. Yeah. Time for the grand finale. Let's get into this hard bag and see what's inside of it. Hopefully not closed, even though, you, oops, I'm just crushing it and stuff. It is a suitcase, so <laughs> kind of expect clothes, but fingers crossed it's not. You ready? Yes. Let's see. Oh no. There's, well, there's stuff hard up there stuff for up sure. There. Look at this. Is this a speaker? Uh, Aqua Boost Boom. So Aqua Boost makes me think it's a what underwater speaker or something. Yeah. Let's see, what's Ooh, this? What's that? that looks interesting. What could that be? Let's see. Oh, well, whatever it is, it's not in there anymore. Let's throw out some of these clothes. Ooh, ooh, ooh. crystal jewelry. Let's see. Dang it, not in there. So we got paperwork, more paperwork. Some more sheets. Let's see. What is this? Um, what is that? Oh, every man jack clay. Okay. Okay. Weird. Random. More change. I got another six cents. And we got to be getting close to a dollar here. <laughs> <laughs> this unit, money galore, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Let's see. Nothing down here, but we definitely heard a lot of rattling up here. Let's spin it around. Let's see what's up top. Maybe some of the jewelry that we're missing. Let's see, is it just open like this? Yes, it does. You got a guess? Um, i say yes, the jewelry. Oh, look. Whoa. A Lenovo tablet. Well, all the electronics. <laughs> but it's seen better days. It has seen better days. This is a portable DVD player. Look at these phones. Hold on, let's see what this is right here. Reaction Kenneth Cole. They paid 50 bucks for this. Let's see what's inside of it though. Come on, something interesting. Oh, Ooh, what is that? Come here. No way. No way. <laughs> there, that is not a Rolex. That is not a Rolex. That's too perfect. That's insane. Uh, let's see, let's shake it up, see if we can get it to run a little bit. It's running and it is sliding. So you're supposed to look for a slide, not a tick. But you know, the downfall is look at the side. That's probably paint coming off. And I would assume if it was a real Rolex, it probably wouldn't be painted. Dang it. But Keep hey, yeah, it's still cool. People still buy the fake ones like 50 bucks all day, 50, $60. Because if you don't want to spend three grand on a watch, hey, look at this, a little miniature camera. I wonder if it's got an SD card in it. That would be interesting. I'm weird like that. I like to look into people's stuff. How do I even open it? I'm trying to figure that out. Okay, there's that part. But how do I get to the battery slash SD card? Right now, that's the charger. I don't know, but it's a Gateway DV S20 camera. We'll figure it out. Let's see what's in here. Any gift cards? That's the question. I think we got them upside down. Um, not seeing anything. That's an actual credit card. So is that one and that one. And yeah, no gift cards in there. But we got a lot of phones here. I'm not ignoring them. I'm just trying to look around for us. Whoa, you see that? Yep. Yeah, we're definitely over a dollar now. We did it, guys. We did it. <laughs> we did it. We went over a dollar. We got a little flip phone, a cracked up LG here. This is a Samsung. It's not cracked. It's just dirty. You know, a couple electronic wipes. That'd be in fine shape. 
This one is cracked. It's a, it's just an LG. It doesn't say what type. This one's another Samsung, but it seems to be missing the battery. This one looks nice. It's gotta be a Samsung or an LG, but it has the model number. It says model LM-K500MM on it. But look at that, five smartphones. That's pretty cool. The last thing, uh, well, I was about to say the last thing's the red box, but the red box seems to be nothing. You know what, for 60 bucks, I think that was a fun one. I think I get bonus points because my guy had over six theft arrests, including arm robbery and resisting arrest. That's gotta be worth something, right? Now we're at my unit and I have a $20 advantage because I only got mine for $40. But you're still gonna lose. No, I'm not. <laughs> Come on. Is it stuck? Uh, uh, I just, come on. Almost broke a finger, but I got it open. <laughs> Check it out. All right, let's bring this out. Let's just get the cooler out of the way because it usually has food and hopefully it doesn't. Fingers crossed. But just in case it's the worst thing, I wanna get it out of the way. So we have a pack of cups. Yeah, some cooler, like hot and cold bags, some forks, looks like somebody went to a party. Some paperwork, uh, these are bags, and then we have a cigarette thingy. And mm. let's see, other than the bags in there, these are just like cloth bags, so nothing in there. So let's check these pockets in the front. The small one has nothing, and we have a toothbrush and a crown. Ooh, toothbrush! <laughs> and an orange crown. So now I'm gonna take out this camper, just because it doesn't seem as full as the boxes. Let's get this out. Let's see what's in it. Okay. So we have some laundry detergent here. This mm -hmm. is like, they're both about here. So like, I'm not even gonna worry about keeping on at all, but we have some snuggle. That's a good load of clothes Stain there. Stain remover, maybe I should use this on the top of the, the thing. Probably should. Something out of my hand. You can have it all, you can have it all. That's nice. <laughs> all right, and down here, we have two towels. And it looks like dirty clothes. I don't really want to dig in there. You got a lot of room to make up. I know. Next thing I'm just going to get down is this. these things. These things actually came in our house. They're like gym mats. Oh. You can put down and like save the floor from the equipment. So that's cool. We have extra ones just in case. This box. Let's get it down. Feels really light. Hopefully, I don't know if that's good or bad. I know. Let's see. A one blanket. Is that really? really just one blanket? Seriously? That is really just one. Oh, I saw something oh. under there. What could be wrapped up in a blanket? Uh, a bottle. Are you kidding me? This or is a glass. <laughs> <laughs> no, one glass. What? Okay, hold on, I need an, another box. <laughs> All right. All right, Teresa's box. I'm feeling really good right about now. Uh, I know, I'm, I'm not, but just like in your unit, we went through everything, we found the shoes, great, but then in the last suitcase in the back. That's true. So hopefully, That's true. hopefully I can get lucky here. Ooh, this is a tutu. Look at you got. Tutu. I could rock it. Blow. You could. <laughs> you could. I could. I could picture it. Maybe I think it look good. Oh, we got a green one too. Maybe oh, yeah. I can have this one. <laughs> All right. What else we got in here? Oh, here's a brand new one. Patriotic tutu. One size fits most. I'm not um, most. <laughs> and we have this thing. Okay. Something All right. to hang your stuff on. And we have one shoe, a heel, which is. No clue. Mosaic, maybe? All right. Maybe that's, that's the brand. Never heard know. of that one. No, I know. Oh, here's the other one. Oh, oh. well. $12. <laughs> 12 no. bucks uh, at 2nd Avenue. <laughs> okay. Uh, everything else is just closed, but we have a camo, Santa hat, and oh, there's the other shoe. So before we get into the next box, please leave it a like and subscribe if you're new because we buy storage units all the time. I feel like this is our first, like, head-to-head -head unit and you know you want to leave it a like on my part, right? Oh, come on. Right. My unit was cool. <laughs> Your unit so far. Don't judge it. You're yeah. so judgmental. I'm an honest man. You are. Very. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there you go. Oh, I thought those were those flowers. What? I thought those were poop stains on the under. I was about to say, there you go. I was like, geez. No, I thought you scored big time. <laughs> All right, so in here, these are closed. I'm like, feel. I'm trying to like fish for stuff. I'm feeling everything. So we have a brand new pair of socks, see? Brand new. There you go. $500, I win. Yeah. <laughs> gardening gloves, gardening gloves, and we have this orange bit. Ooh, we have some randomness down here. 
There you go. Bag. And we have some couple stockings, which are brand new. Oh, I see an apple box. No way you're okay, about to get okay, lucky. Okay, okay, okay. Hold on, let's get to it. Yeah, these are just like random wires. Random wires. What is this? What does that say? Gigaware? A router, maybe it's storage or a router. Gigaware. It doesn't have like a model number or anything on it. I've never right. heard of it though. Uh, this is a smoke thing. A car thing. Okay, let's get in. There's two. There's two? There's two iPhone boxes. What iPhone is it? They are, let's see, iPhone 12 Pro oh, Max. Oh my goodness. No way. Yeah, right both now. of them are. iPhone 12. No way. Ooh. Okay, okay, okay. No, I, I can't lift anymore, so nothing in that one. And then this one, bam! Oh, oh. just a little like pin thingy. Dang it! <laughs> Dang it! Was that all that's in there? Or you got uh, more. Then we no? have this is a wireless charging thing, green screen backdrop. Nice. Nice. Brand new micro USB cable. I think it came from Dollar Tree, but you know. <laughs> uh, this is Sonic. Hmm. I don't, what is this like different sounds just to play in the background? You see it? That's Gray it noise, brown like noise, wind, thunder. <laughs> That's kind of cool. And then lastly, a brand new thing at your boots. I was going to save the big box for last, but I feel like I'm going to go through that next because I feel like better stuff's going to be in the little one. I hope you're right. I hope you're right. Okay. We have um, pillows and TV. <laughs> what kind of TV is in here? I don't know. So let's see. Okay. Definitely pillows on top. So they did not lie. All right. Pillow. Hello, hello. Okay. Uh, oh, uh, oh, there it is. Ha ha. TV. There is a TV down there. I thought There's they were BSing. Over here. So what do we got? We have an Insignia Model NS24. So it's a 24-inch TV. All right, that's got to be All worth right. a little something. It's a nice flat screen. Yeah, nice. And down here, pillow and pillow. Nothing else. Okay, I have one chance left, and that's with this little box here. So let's get it out. Cross your Come fingers. Come on, little box. Come on, little box. Everybody, right now, cross your fingers and toes. All right. For me. <laughs> okay, off the bat, not looking too good. <sighs> so let me toss them in here. Make sure there's nothing under there. I really, I really have to fish for this right now because I don't know. Hey. No, it's all socks and sweaters, and there's nothing in the socks. No. <laughs> So, I think it's safe to say... I have been defeated. You've been defeated!